consequences. An alert tonight about illegal drugs laced with a toxic powder called Rizzy. Well, police are sounding the alarm after the shocking effects on a man in Ohio. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmerini live tonight digging up more about these dangers. Brianne? Well, Stephen and Carolyn, I did a little online research and it wasn't hard to find Rizzy. It's pretty easy, actually. Uh, this is an online printout. It comes in multiple colors. Now, it's marketed as something to be added to floral arrangements to change the color of flower petals. But drug dealers could potentially be using it for something more deadly. These blurred pictures show a man's skin eaten away. They're photos of a man Ohio police arrested for heroin. The 25 year old man told police he bought heroin laced with Rizzy, resulting in black marks and peeling skin. And word about Rizzy is spreading through law enforcement outlets. The chief in West Bloomfield says illegal drugs don't come with quality control. And they don't really care that you're what you're putting into your body. They don't really care that it cause have a toxic effect. They can start eating away your flesh like some of the news reports we're seeing. They don't care about those things. All they care is about making the sale. Chief Patton says it's likely an additive dealers are using to expand their product, but users could also believe Rizzy is adding to their high. This is another addition to what we have already realized is a national crisis regarding the abuse of heroin. The heroin and opioid epidemic is sweeping the nation, and it's a serious problem here in Metro Detroit. We've had over 40 heroin overdoses in just here in West Bloomfield, 11 of which have been fatal. Tonight, I reached out to the online company I found selling Rizzy. The number is a Detroit number. But the man said he couldn't comment on the problem. He said Rizzy is only supposed to be used for flowers. It is listed as toxic online. A product that's used to change the colors and flower petals that has legitimate use is being abused. And the company needs to be responsible in how and where and who they're selling these products to. I did reach out to several local florists and I talked to one in Pontiac and she said she had never heard of Rizzy and it's not something she's ever used to dye flowers. Live tonight, Brianne Pomerini, 7 Action News. All right, Brianne, thank you for the report.